Hello YouTube, this is LEGO Dude 999100. Coming at you with a new segment I would like to call Hasbro Before the Clone Wars Was Cancelled. This segment is to capture some of the greatest action figures that Hasbro ever made for the Clone Wars. And to start off, my personal favorite would have to be Rear Captain Rex. He has full articulation in the legs and arms, and his hands can move. As you can see, he has the dual pistols, the antenna, the helmet, then he's got the head, then he got the um, pauldron, waist cape, gun holders, then you got the stand, then you just got all his... 501st blue markings, the blue around the waist cape. Yep, so that's Rex. Then my second favorite is Commander Cody. As you see, he has his DC 15 blaster right there. Then you got the helmet with the, um, range finder thing got the orange visor the um whatever you call it that searchlight thing then you got all that then commander cody just has a regular clone face Then we get to the season one through three, it is Anakin Skywalker. Not much, just irregular Anakin Skywalker, blue lightsaber, the robotic arm right there. Then we got the season one for three Obi Wan Kenobi. Again, not much on him. Just your blue lightsaber. Then the armoring or whatever it is. <coughs> then we got the season three through five Anakin Skywalker with the blade it's a little too blue like it's like a really actually it's more of a um transparent blue color then this one actually has a lot more better detailing than season one or three Anakin Skywalker as you can see I got the season three through five. Obi Wan lightsaber is the same as the newer Anakin. Yeah. So where's that? Then the best two for last as of right now. Um, we'll start with Savajo Press, the dual bladed lightsaber, you have the armoring on him, got the waist cape, the horns, and that's about it for him. Then we got Darth Maul, cyborg. From the Target exclusive pack, I think it was like Night Sisters. It was from one of those episodes. Got the robotic legs. Then you got the markings on his chest and his face. Then you got the horns, a single bladed lightsaber. But it's actually kind of like a pink, purple color. Then you got his like gloves, 
or robotic hands, arms, whatever you want to call them. Then you got that thing around his neck. And that's about it for this, guys. And whenever I find any more good Hasbro action figures throughout the years of the Clone Wars, I will possibly pick those up and do reviews on them in segments like this. This has been the very first Clone Wars action figure from Hasbro. And rate, comment, and subscribe, guys. Put in the comments if you want to see more of these kind of segments. And this has been LEGO Dude 999100. Peace out.